Many farmers in the comment section of our videos have been asking how do I treat the chicken when they have a whitish color on the comb or a reddish color or even purple color. And that is why in this video I want to discuss about different diseases that affect the chicken and manifest as color changes in the wattles and the combs of the chicken. I will also give you the best natural treatments that can be applied to the affected combs and wattles to help eliminate and treat these diseases. Any kind of color change from the normal deep red color is an indic indicator of a condition or an infection that is affecting your chickens. The first infection is the avian influenza. And the avian influenza is, is a deadly viral disease that causes blue combs and wattles in chickens. Some of the other signs apart from the blue combs and wattles is that you, you can see the red spots on legs and combs, facial swellings, difficulties in breathing, and even soft-shelled eggs. This disease may be mild, meaning that the chickens may be able to fight the virus and recover from this disease. But when this disease is severe and fatal, it causes a lot of death in the flock. And therefore, it is very important to notify your vet because it is highly infectious. The birds that are affected are usually killed because the disease can spread to many other farms and kill a large number of flocks. But before we get into this video, kindly if you haven't subscribed to our YouTube channel, make sure that you hit that subscribe button and also hit that bell notification so that every time that I post another educative video, YouTube will alert you. Also, make sure to hit that like button and also the share button because they help this video to be shown to more farmers so that they can be able to get this important information. You can also tell us where you are watching us from and leave your suggestions and questions in the comment section below. The second disease that affects the combs and tomatoes is the fullpox. Fullpox is a viral infection that manifests as a black as black nodules on the combs and wattles around the eyes and even the ears of the chickens. The best prevention measure of fullpox is to vaccinate your chickens. Some of the best Natural treatments to use is by applying the herbal toothpaste on the affected combs and wattles. The second way is by using the lemon juice. You are going to cut the lemon and as you press the lemon, you carefully rub it on the affected combs and wattles and this helps the wounds to heal faster. The other treatment that also you can use to apply on these wounds caused by the full pox is the garlic extract. The third disease is the full cholera. Full cholera is a bacterial disease that also affects the combs and the wattles. It leads to the swelling of the wattles and a purple color on the combs and the wattles. One of the best ways to prevent this disease is through vaccination. There are two natural treatments that you can use to treat this fall cholera. Here are the ingredients and preparation procedure of the first natural treatment. And after preparing this treatment, you are going to use 15 ml of the treatment into each liter of the chickens drinking water. The second natural treatment to full cholera is capsicum. You are going to chop and grind or smash 25 grams of capsicum and add them into each liter of the chickens drinking water. This capsicum contains active compounds that helps the chicken to fight off these bacteria that cause full cholera. The other disease affecting the combs and the wattles is the fungal infections. When the fungi affect the combs and the wattles of the chicken, you are going to see white spots on the combs and the wattles and sometimes even a whitish powder and skin may come off the affected combs. The natural treatments to use so as to treat these fungal infections. Number one is the apple cider vinegar and fermented milk. 
and what this apple cider vinegar and fermented milk do is that, is that they are acidic in nature and therefore they are going to help to kill the fungi that may be causing these whitish spots on the combs and the wattles. The other natural treatments are the tea tree oil, coconut oil and the aloe vera. All of these three are also to be applied on these affected combs and wattles. The fifth important disease is the parasitic infections and this is where the fleas and the mites attach on the combs and the wattles and this is because wattles and combs are highly vascularized means meaning that they contain a lot of capillaries whereby the blood flows through them and therefore due to the fact that there is a lot of blood vessels in the combs and the wattles this makes the mites and the fleas want to attach on this parts of the chicken so that they can be able to feed on the blood natural treatments that you can use to eliminate these parasites number one is by dusting your chickens with diatomaceous earth powder you can also smear the combs and the waters with garlic extract or use essential oils like the tea tree oil lavender oil or even the cinnamon oil these are also to be smeared on the affected combs and waters and also there's another tr natural treatment which is coconut oil and the aim of these oils is to help and suffocate these mites and fleas click the video that is on your screen right now to know the eight most common diseases in chickens and the natural treatments to use to treat them